As we said at the beginning, it wasn't too long ago that mobile technology was something that only existed in science fiction. And even when it first became a reality, it was only available to a select few if it was available at all. But over the years, mobile technology steadily improved, allowing more and more users to do more and more with their mobile phones. Let's look back at our analogy we used in the last chapter to describe how it all worked. Remember, spectrum or all of the available frequency available to mobile technology is like a limited parcel of land and the people who live on this land are the mobile users looking to make a connection. 1G was like building small homes on the land with large distances between each one and an inefficient delivery service that could deliver voice to one person per house. With 2G we went digital, which enabled us to compress these voice shipments into packages to allow more calls per shipment and allowed us to replace those individual homes with a large apartment building to let more people or callers in the same land, much more efficient. With 3G, we added an additional delivery truck optimized for larger data shipments, allowing users to get larger packages when they needed them. So then, what does 4G LTE do? Simply put, 4G LTE makes everything faster and better. Now that mobile devices include a rich data experience, we must find ways to provide that experience without delay and at faster speeds. Not only does 4G LTE help accomplish this, it also has a roadmap to address the ever-looming issue of network capacity as billions more connections are added and richer content is demanded. How does 4G LTE do all this? Several ways. The first innovation that 4G LTE introduced was support for much wider channels, which allows more users to get on the network at the same time and faster connections once they're on it. In our analogy, this would be like widening the roads and trucks, allowing them to service more people with more packages at once, already much more efficient. Secondly, 4G LTE enabled multiple antennas to help transport the data to and from mobile devices. In our analogy, that would be like adding an entire story onto our delivery trucks, effectively doubling the capacity of the truck or the data rate in the network. Thirdly, 4G LTE aggregates available spectrum whenever possible to help deliver more information faster. This is like sending multiple double-decker delivery trucks to the apartment building at a time instead of one. Amazing improvement. What it all amounts to is the fastest, most efficient mobile network ever created. And despite the massive number of new residents moving into our building, or in the real world, the millions of new smart devices that join the mobile world every day, 4G LTE has seamlessly ushered the world into the next era of mobile broadband. With 4G LTE, we are providing faster, better connections for mobile broadband experiences. And with 3G constantly improving as well, we can provide this excellent mobile broadband experience virtually anywhere you go. As long as your phone has multi-mode 3G and 4G LTE support, you should be able to enjoy a virtually seamless mobile broadband experience just about anywhere in the world. Let's take a closer look at this multi-mode capability to understand why both 3G and 4G LTE technologies are needed to provide you with the best user experience.